And now, our feature presentation. Congratulations, you're on camera too. What are you doing? What brings you by? What's, what's, your, what's your goal? What's happening? Like, what is your purpose? Because I'm practicing my Canadian Charter rights to film in public. Oh, the Canadian Charter rights. Who give a shit about your rights? Somebody called and complained about you, but don't worry. We're going to go in and educate them. It's all about what you're doing. It's perfect for me. Bust it. Guess who's back? Welcome back. It's Canadian Rights Media. I'm here at Southview Church here in the southeast part of Calgary. I'm at this location for a special reason. So don't think, oh great, another church video. But this one has a special connection to another video of mine. And I'll explain it to you in a moment. So while I'm here, let's see if the pastors in the congregation will respect our Canadian rights of freedom of the press of taking videos and pictures from a public standpoint. Let's find out. Oh, well, I'm here. Someone's cleaned the inside glass window. See? Wipe, wipe, wipe. Wax on, wax off. Well, he's doing the wax on, but not really the wax off. All right, so you're wondering, okay, so what does this church have a connection with one of your videos. Well, if you all remember this sergeant. Sergeant Andrew Harnett, Regimental 4601. Okay, thank you. What can we do for you? I'll never ask for any help. Just one of those audit people that's doing this for a YouTube thing. And after Sergeant Andrew Harnett was killed in line of duty, this church was the location of his funeral. So, I've been really wanting to come and uh, visit this location for a while and I finally got a chance to, so, yeah. So I just kind of got here, the first service is over, the second service is going to be starting soon. Is there an individual cleaning the glass? on the doors some people in the lobby area chit-chatting having a cup of coffee talking about their week probably talking about the nfl season that's starting or maybe the nhl who knows all right so as people are leaving from the first service this is one of the two main entrances into this church if i remember right for mega churches, this is Calgary's third mega church. It's behind uh, Center Street and First Alliance. First Alliance is one of the mega mega churches. So this church has two services. As I said, people are leaving. Uh, so this is um, after the funeral. The um, funeral parade or the entourage or whatever it's called. They exit from the other side of the building, the front end. And they exit through this location and down this road to where Sergeant Arnett is buried. Well, technically not buried, he was actually cremated. So, um, not too sure, I did some researching, not too sure where, what happened if his widow uh, took the ashes or if he was put into a crypt. So, I'm too sure. I did notice while coming up, they have a Frisbee golf practice set up just right over there. As the Jeep kind of blocks my way, <laughs> or blocks the view. Not really block my way. Boy, I'm rusty. 
Rusties, nice friendly wave. And I'm not talking about Rusties from the car movie with Lightning McQueen. Looks like right through there they have a coffee bar. Coffee shop where you get coffee. Guess he came and decided to leave. Can you tell me how to get to Sesame Street? Why are you videotaping me? Because I can? That's kind of weird. It's pretty weird. Some guy just coming up and asking somebody why they're being videotaped. Like yeah, it is. Why? You're being videotaped everywhere you go, man. As soon as you leave your house, you're guaranteed to be caught on video within two minutes. Yeah, just because I can. You too. There's a gold beamer. Beamer. Oh, I spy with my little eye. Bunch of security cameras on a light post. The workers still busy cleaning the doors. Security dude just rode right past me. All right, so this is the best I could get for uh, the view of the front of the church. Uh, so here, after this funeral service, they um, came out and loaded the remains of Sergeant Andrew Hartnett, back of uh, Calgary City Police Hearse, which is an old CPS van. I think this person needs some rusties for their rusted GMC truck. Oh, here's a Mini Mini. There's a Mercedes Mercedes. A Kia Kia. There goes the Mini Mini. And a Ford. I'm sorry, that's one ugly color for our car. Good. How are you? Good, and you, sir? Good. Just ask you, come and see if you want to come in for a coffee. I'd like to treat you to a coffee. Well, I'm good. Are you sure? Hi. Okay. Thanks for the offer. Well, we just saw you out here and thought, huh. If, you, if you're feeling like you're not invited in, you're certainly invited in. So please come in and have a free coffee on us. Well, thank you for your offer. Absolutely. My name's Andrew. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You're from around here? Calgary, ain't you? Okay, nice. Yeah. yeah. Um, so if you were a big family, so if you want to come in, I'd love to have you. Uh, what domination of Christianity is this church? We're Alliance. So Missionary Alliance. Oh, okay. Yeah. So not really... Not really a religious type of church. We just we follow the gospel and just looking for our community outreach church. So everything about us is about community outreach. Whatever we do to support the community, bring people in, show them the love of Christ. That's pretty much it. We have activities throughout the week, seven days a week. This place is really busy. Youth events, counseling events, children's events, that kind of thing. But yeah, we do a lot of missionary support overseas and things like that. We've sent a lot of people out from our church to other countries. Yeah, so that's it's the nature of our church. Not really a religious component, but yeah, biblical. Um, my understanding is this church is about, well, what, seven, nine years old, or is it? Uh, we moved here seven years ago, but our old campus we grew out of on James McKenna, you know James McKenna at the top of the hill. I think it's uh, uh, Asian Alliance now, or Chinese Alliance. Bought it, but we grew out of that. But we were there for, I'm gonna say 20 some years prior to this location. And yeah, this one was a long time in the making, but when the community opened up a place for church to build, we were able to get a nice sized campus and then We've got almost to the back of the hill, so we actually put in, um, you know, the... Uh, Go yeah, the, the golf. Yeah, 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 I saw that when yeah. I got here. So we put that in for the community to engage and just people coming for dog walks and all that stuff. So, yeah, we used to have 
the basketball nets and stuff like that, but it got a little rowdy on the weekends. Like people come in with the cars and doing burnouts and stuff like that. And it was really ticking off the community. So we kind of had to put in something else that was less uh, open and free for people to come and rip their cars around. Cause yeah, we understand like people who live here don't want that kind of stuff in the evenings and stuff like that. Right? Oh yeah. So, yeah, so it was more like that, but yeah. No, yeah, we've been here seven years, hard to believe. It's time's flying, but yeah. Any other questions? Or no. Happy to answer? Okay. Nice to meet you. Brother. Nice to meet you too. And please feel free if you want to come in. We'll, uh, we'll treat you up for coffee or whatever you like. Okay. Okay. God care. bless. You too. As I said, I was preparing to leave. He. I'm just going to show you. Like I know with the camera, it doesn't show it, but it's a it's a good distance. From where I am to the to the building, so he walked across here to just talk, and I think it was a great conversation. Wow! Well, hey everyone, what's your thoughts? Come up below, fill or pass, and if you haven't, please subscribe, follow, and like. And I'm also on TikTok. I know I have to start posting more TikTok videos, but I'm there. And, and if you haven't figured out by now, I am back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. And I promise I will stop singing on the future videos. Till next time. Is there any particular reason that you're taking photos and videos in the police station, sir? As a matter of security, it's generally speaking not a common occurrence. Do you have any particular business here? Guess he never got his Timmy's today.